Yes, we just announced our new brand new processor, Ryzen. It's an eight core, 16 thread CPU. It's got full SOC, has all kinds of great details on there, as well as CPU cores. We've got USB, SATA, as well as PCI Express Gen 3 and DDR4 memory controller. So it's an SOC with lots of stuff going on. Yeah, absolutely. It's uh, full connectivity straight from the socket, and our new chipset's going to expand those in infrastructure options even more. Compared to previous uh, chips? Great question. So, we're going to have the industry's biggest generational leap in performance with Ryzen. So, we're increasing our IPC, our instructions per clock, by over 40% versus our previous generation. So, it's going to be going up in performance, but at the same time, we're not increasing power. It's going to keep that same low power at the same time. Is it a lower nanometer? Yes, it's new 14 nanometer technology. So that helps, right? Absolutely, it's a strong part of what we're doing. So a new 14 nanometer technology and our great design teams learning how to make the most of those transistors. So it's running right here in this one? What, yeah. what is the demo that you show here? So here you can see, this is, so what you're looking at here is Star Wars Battlefront with the Rogue One DLC, and we're playing a 4K resolution with Ultra HD preset, and it's a 60 frames per second locked, as fast as it can, as it can want to go, it can do it. It's a beautiful game, and what we're seeing here is powering our new Vega graphics card. So what's this new graphics that you have? Yeah, so Vega's our new graphics architecture, and the Vega graphics architecture is designed for high performance computing and gaming. And we're going to have a great uh, launch this year with this new product. So this is the latest uh, ATI? Yeah. The, so, the fastest Radeon? Yeah, the new fast Radeon, 14 nanometer as well. We've got support for all the great new technologies and support standards. And we're showing it off today, the two new technologies coming together, AMD's new high performance PC. This is going to be the most desirable gaming PC for 2017. So is this the fastest PC, the fastest GPU in the world? Well, it's too early to say yet. Yeah, once we launch this to the market, we'll see what the consumers think. Hopefully, you guys will say yes. Is this is better than Intel and better than Nvidia. That's what we're aiming for: is to be the best that we can be, offer a great experience, and redefine some performance. But it's also about price, right? Value. Yeah. So, what's going to be the price? Well, we don't know yet. We haven't disclosed the pricing just yet. We'll be happy to let that know when we go to market. But for right now, we've shown demos where our CPU is outperforming the competition's $1,000 CPU. So my question to you is, now that you know they can beat a $1,000 CPU, how much should we charge? I think 129 is a good price, so I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, I'm just joking. I don't know. So, uh, so then there's a, this is a desktop platform. Are you doing this for laptops also? Yeah, the Zen architecture will go into every business that we have today. So you'll see it in notebooks, you'll see it in semi-custom, you'll see it in enterprise and server high performance compute, Zen is going to go everywhere, and everywhere it will bring those same great benefits. All right, so uh, how soon are people buying this? Be Q1. Q1 is uh, at the latest in March, right? That's right. 